Hello there, welcome to Rainy Cat's uh, Geek in the Kitchen Vegan Cookery Blah. Uh, today I'm making a very special carrot and pineapple cake for Mr. Cat, it's his birthday. Uh, I've got all the ingredients ready I hope, so uh, I'm going to read them out to you. Just a sec while I turn the camera around. Now, um, these are all done in cups and teaspoons that you can get from any kind of hardware store and they're really good, they're a really good way of measuring if you uh, don't want to use scales because they're very quick and easy so here's my list of ingredients and uh, I'll just read them out to you so I've got um, uh, two and a half cups of grated carrot I'm going to eat those extra bits later that, that's very dangerous so I'm nearly uh, lost a bit of my hands. <laughs> Never mind. Um, I've got um, two and a quarter uh, cups of all-purpose flour waiting in the in the big bowl. Uh, I've got baking soda, so you want uh, two teaspoons of baking soda, two teaspoons of cinnamon, one teaspoon of allspice, uh, one teaspoon of baking powder. Uh, one teaspoon of salt, I have got some salt, uh, so three quarters of a cup of light brown sugar, uh, three egg, egg replacer equivalents, so three of those, the measures of those, uh, one teaspoon of vanilla, uh, one cup of vegetable oil, uh, one can of uh, drained um, mushed up pineapple that I put in the whizzy whiz, uh, a cup of coconut desiccated and some optional nuts and raisins which I'll get put in the whizzy wig in a moment. Uh, back in a sec. So here's most of the dry stuff in a bowl and I'm just going to add about 200 ml of water that goes with the um, egg replacer and I'm going to stir that in until it's lovely and creamy and into this I'm putting a cup of sunflower oil I use sunflower oil because I think it tastes nicer than vegetable oil so into my uh, bowl of mixed up uh, dried uh, ingredients of like sugar, flour, baking powder um, there's a bit of vanilla essence in there um, I've bunged in some of the raisins that came out of the mixed fruit and uh, nut packet. There's some vanilla there that you can see and um, there's a huge amount of um, chocolates there so I won't be giving this to any of my nut allergy suffering friends. Um, in here goes my two cups of um, chopped carrots and um, Oh yes, and I don't know how I'm going to do this. I'm going to put in here my uh, tin of pineapple that I put through the whizzy whiz, and I'm also going to chuck in the juice from the tin that I didn't put in the whizzy whiz. And um, oh yes, a cup of desiccated coconut. That's a half a cup. Um, I am going to put another half cup in, but this is a bit tricky to uh, do <coughs> with one camera, hand, hand camera, camera, hand holding the camera. So there you go, that's a lot of coconut. So I'm going to mix all this lovely stuff together now. Mm. And this. Hopefully it will turn into a nice batter. Anyway, I definitely can't mix all this together with one hand and film it and it would be very boring. So I will be back in a sec. So I think uh, my mix is just about ready. And um, here's my cake tin. Uh, okay. I need to grease my cake tin and I've got... Uh, a really cute uh, heart shaped cake tin and I'm going to make sure that's well 
well and truly greased. I'm not going to use um, uh, grease proof paper because I get in such a mess with it and it's such a pain in the bottom for me to uh, pull off. It gets inside the cake mix and everything so it ends up more uh, causing more trouble than it's worth. Um, and I'm setting the temperature this should be in the oven. I'm going to put this in the oven right now to 350 degrees and I'll tell you in a minute what that is in the other doodah. And um, I did end up putting in all the nuts, so no nuts for you know who, uh, no cake for them. And um, it's already more or less to, well, ready to go in. It's got all the spices in and everything and it's all mixed up and looking rather yummy. So, back in a sec. So, here's the cake mix in the tin. There wasn't a cat's chance in hell that I was going to be able to pour it in and hold the camera. So, um, here's a quick skip to mix. And I'm going to put this in the oven now uh, for about 45 minutes. So, um, actually, it's uh, an hour and a bit later. The cake took longer than I thought it was going to take. But, um, I've got it out of the oven now and um, mm, I've singed it a bit on top but I, I think it's going to be okay. So here's the cake and uh, it looks a bit darker than it actually is and I'm going to wait for it to cool down and then I'm going to make a topping for it. Hello, so now I've uh, got the cake out of the oven, uh, it's cooled down and um, I'm ready to make the frosting. So. Um, Let's have a look over here. So here's my cake. Um, I let it cool down on a drying rack for an hour and uh, put it on a plate now because I won't want to move it again once I've done the frosting. And the uh, that is made with, um, I've got a tub of uh, soya vegan cream cheese, a third of a cup of vegan margarine, and two cups of icing sugar Whee! which I'm going to cream together to spread on the cake and I'm going to do that now so those ingredients are all nice and creamy together now and that wasn't very hard at all although it did look a bit like gunky at first so there you go uh, I'm going to put that on my cake and uh, by the way it did take more than a little bit longer than the 40 minutes I specified to cook it it took more like an hour just because um, it did need a bit more extra cooking inside because um, it's actually quite a dense cake so I'm now going to put my um, my uh, soy cream cheese icing on the carrots and pineapple cake so I'm just going to finish off doing the sprinkles. These are lovely um, naturally, oh, natural coloured sugar sprinkles that are coloured with uh, beetroot. Whee! Very pretty. And um, I'm not sure that uh, actual icing would set on this because it's kind of quite, um, doesn't really set. So I'm going to do some special decorating with some chocolate chips. And now I've finished the decorating with the uh, sugar crystals and the chocolate drops and it's all ready for Mr Cat and I'm just going to add the candles, yay! Um, so there we are, um, carrot and pineapple cake, yay! So all that's left for me to do is to take my penny off and light the candles and sing happy birthday, yay!